Two weeks came and went, and I was miraculously still here. Weeks turned into months, and eventually, through a long, arduous road, I was cured. I'm not sure why this happened, if it was a miracle or not. But now, I had this new mission. Maybe the universe decided my life's work wasn't done. My new lease on life was devoted to helping others and touching their lives in meaningful ways. Everything I do is to honor that pledge. And hopefully, in some small way, I'm adding life to your life. Hi guys! So let me help you understand further on how to watch the readings. So remember, this is going to be based on Vedic sidereal astrology, not Western. So if you're watching this from your sun sign, then the resonance of the energy will be happening on a soul level. Now, if you are watching this from your ascendant, then from ascendant, it's happening towards the physical manifestation of the reading. And then, if you are watching this on your moon sign, then this is going to be resonating from your feelings, your mind, and your thoughts. Now, for the people who are looking for that masculine energy, then you would have to look for Jupiter in your chart so that you will know how the energy works. And then, if for the people who are attracted to the feminine energy, then you would have to look for Venus. Now, do remember that Venus also rules the energy of the relationship, so that would be also helpful for you. Now that you guys are all set, thank you very much, and let's begin with your reading. Hi, Aquarius. Welcome to my channel. We're doing your reading. How are you? <laughs> Someone's excited. I don't know. Maybe it's you. <laughs> Let me get first a zodiac here, guys. Let's get a zodiac. <laughs> Oh, I got a chariot, which is Cancerian. Okay. We got here Hierophant, which is Taurus. We uh, got here Leo, Sun cards. Okay. And we got here Gemini. Okay. We all get separate reading and extended. Um, just to give you guys heads up. Heads up, because something is on the up. Okay. Either in my left corner or the right. Okay. It's the late night. Um, we have different uh, reads at night. So, so we're gonna be posted over there, and then at the same time, um, how do you call this? Uh, it's all zodiacs, and at the end there's a gen, uh, a collective uh, reading. Um, so for people who has missed out the twelve zodiacs that we put that we put every day, you have one more chance at night. Okay, <laughs> so it's right here. Okay. Also for personal, it's in the description box. There's limited time that I will be doing personal, and then that's it. Also, okay, just to give you guys a heads up. And I think we're gonna start. Um, we're gonna start with the oracle card for the aqua, and then we'll go with the tarot. How about that? Okay, so let's see. Mm, oracle. Oracle, oracle, aqua, aqua. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Let's see here. Here we go. Chop wood, got a time for a nap, and the truth be told. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, how it works. Um, number 42, 24, and 14. Uh, um, you're asking or you're questioning this time out that you guys have. Okay. So, this is where your situation is. Um, because for you, you don't want to be stalled and it's almost like, why are we taking a break or it's not an or, it's really just that's it, you know? I mean, and you're asking your friends like, why are you not talking to me? Why are you not talking to me? Why are we on a break or why are, why there's no movement also? This is one of your questions, like why there's no movement? Mm hmm you feel like it's being on hold or the connection is being on delay for a reason here or for some reason okay why are we not moving you know where is this going you know so you have a lot of questions right now with this person like so many questions after questions Ooh, not a best card someone's avoiding us 
someone is not being sincere about what they're telling you also. So you might get an excuse, okay? So why are we in a break? Why are we not talking? This person is going to give you an excuse to buy time. Mm hmm Okay. Why or why? Oh, okay. So you might call it a day. Aqua. You might just get tired. You have the death card, you know. And you're just basically going to say, it's like, you know what? This is over. Um, because of... I feel like you're gonna find out that it's because uh, the truth is gonna be told here, right? Um, since the truth is being told, and you will find out that this person is making an excuse, and chances are this is it. This is where you draw the line. You're not gonna have it anymore. It's just like, yep, I'm over, Sal. I'm so over this right now. Finito. Um, because it's like for you, okay. If we're gonna take a break, it's not a break is a breakup. If we're gonna end this, we're gonna end it. So you're gonna pull the the, the plug or the trick or the plug, the plug. Mm -hmm. Because this person left you clueless. Two of ones with the world card. All right, two, two of ones. Two of ones with the truth be told. Because they're just wondering and waiting, okay? Or you're just w waiting and wondering for this person's answer, and then since they give you that messy kind of an answer, which wasn't, it wasn't really real. Basically, you don't buy their excuse. Nine of Cups. Mm -hmm. So this person's excuse is basically, I feel like this is selfish kind of energy, especially with the Page of Pentacles, Seven of Swords. It's about you know, it's like well, you know, you know, it's like they're. I mean, they're happy with this situation right now. So it's like, no, you know, let's take this, like that. You know, it's like, because they want it, a nine of cups, I feel like this person wants it to be casual. But of course, if you're not into casual, then it's not gonna work out. You know, it's like, I'm not gonna be involved with you, death card, with a, you know, it's like, you're taking a snooze, I'm ending this. And you, you know, you're showing as a queen of wands and it means like you know your value with a death card. So you're done. I'm not gonna have this. Three of Cups. Mm hmm Because you're always wondering if there's other people involved also. Mm -hmm. I don't normally go with the Three of Cups energy as a third party, but considering this person has a hidden agenda, okay, and this is what you're thinking. Okay. Wondering if they have. You could also be, but you can't, because you can't, this is, can't be a reconciliation card because if, if you're, if you ended it, then why are you going to have reconciliation, right? So, meaning you have this inside your head. We'll get to the bottom. Okay. Well, chances are you just, you're also going to ignore it. Go to two of pentacles. It's a no time for me. Like, no time. Got no time for this, uh, this games that this person is bringing you i feel like this person is bringing you um to something that's confusing because mm -hmm. it's like it benefits them like you could be also doing a lot of things for this person and they enjoy it mm -hmm. like you're totally totally involved invested oh yeah someone's gonna end this ten of swords this is where it's leading uh huh. Because you 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 can't like. Uh, you're not gonna be dating a person who is that kind of energy. Seven of Swords to the Page of Pentacles. Always coming out excuses after excuses after excuses. Okay. It's almost like this person is a pink slip. Uh huh. Always have a pink slip to you know when you're wondering why are you here. It's like a pink slip. Okay. Ten of Pentacles. If you cut this person off, I feel like you have more, um, better chances into someone new. Because right away, if you end this, this is not going to get to you with this person. This is someone different. Totally different. Because you're closing a chapter of someone who likes to put you in a loop. Mm -hmm. So you're always going to be just for the benefit of them with the Nine of Cups. And then you're not available for this someone who wants to be serious. Okay. And this is not a reconciliation. You're, cu you're cutting this person off. I don't... Vice versa for cross-watcher. It's about cutting, letting go of someone who has always been um, 
making excuses, okay? So link down there in the description box for the extended. Everything you need, it's just down there. Uh, I'm gonna continue with Gemini. You have um, the Leo. You got the Hierophant, which is Taurus and Cancerian. Um, in the extended, separate reading. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. Paki like, paki share. Bon noche, bon day. Bye. King of Swords, which is you. You're really determined to just uh, call it a day with this person. It's like, I'm done. You will meet people, you will travel, you will see a lot of things after you end this chapter of your life. So it's almost like closing of chapter of someone who always just... You got a Hierophant, you got a Two of Swords, Strength card. So this.